Hey guys, this is AB from Team WBT, um, bringing you another video of a first strike attack in one of our recent wars. Um, this is a mid Town Hall 9 taking on a, a relatively high Town Hall 9. Uh, let's do a little bit of base analysis here. The the base itself is it's an okay base. Um, there's lots of double locations, potential double locations. He's likely got all of the Teslas in the middle, um, which is very common for these types of bases. Uh, the Clan Castle is a relatively easy lure uh, and the queen is relatively easy to get to. Uh, she is high level which can cause some problems but shouldn't be much problem getting into her. Uh, there are some double locations that are a little problematic um, but let's see how Chief uh, breaks down the space here. Here is a, uh, a diagram of where all the potential bomb spots are. Um, the black dots represent of course the bombs. Um, you can see there's uh, a ton in the core and then upper left by the queen, bottom left and right as I said before. Um, the golem portion of this attack, this is a, a golem hog attack by the way, uh, golem portion of this attack could come from um, you know 8 o'clock, 9 o'clock, 10, 11, 12 o'clock, but you sort of want to look at um, the, the way where you can eliminate most of those double bomb locations and also get to the queen. So here's a uh, sketch representation of how Chief is going to hit this base. Um, he's going to come in with two golems from the upper left, um, like the 11, 12 o'clock position, and he's going to jump into the queen, also into the core. Um, the jump spell uh, will overlap that four space compartment, get him through that double bomb, potential double bomb location, and then into the core, uh, also eliminating or ruling out some additional bomb locations there. Um, it's easy to think of it as sort of like, uh, like Pac-Man, you're trying to eat all the dots, as many dots as you can. Hogs are going to come from the upper right at this point, um, and what's left after the Golem Squad will get to the middle are essentially uh, parallel or uh, bombs that you'll be able to stagger if you come from the upper right. So let's take a look at the attack now, um, and then first, of course, his army composition. He's using two Golems, two Witches, eight Wizards, three Wall Breakers, four Minions, uh, which are going to be used to help funnel on the upper left, uh, and then some giants to help tank the, the 22 hogs that are going to be coming in sporadically from the upper right. Um, uh, one note about minions funneling, um, if you find an area that has uh, on your entry point that has almost no air coverage like you see by those dark barracks, uh, minions can be useful. Sometimes they even survive um, to clean up in the end. Um, so just, just a side note, um, two minions is the same as a wizard. Doesn't do as much burst damage, um, but still can be useful. Um, so here we go with the attack. Uh, he's going to go with his two golems. They're taking minimal damage there. Um, minions and wizards to funnel. And then his wall breakers come in and do the job perfectly. Here come the witches, the heroes. They're going to funnel off of that um, jelly collector. Clan castle is triggered and there goes the poison to help clean up those fast. Uh, wizards come in uh, as follow up and they do get placed slightly to the right which end up uh, ends up moving them uh, over and a few get killed. Uh, jump goes down, Queen gets killed, and the double bomb there is popped. Uh, meanwhile, a giant and some hogs come in from the top right. You'll see that um, that he does hit a bomb there, so he does have to throw down an early heal. Um, but there is no bombs on the right, it looks like, so his plan is, um, is going relatively well so far. The second heal comes down uh, and covers his hogs into that bomb, which is kind of a random bomb, didn't expect one there. Meanwhile, the, the Golem Squad's cleaning up nicely in the middle, and then you'll see he uh, drops that third heal to cover the remaining bomb spots that he uh, he thought, but at this point he'd already hit four, so he's good. Um, just needs to clean up the last few defenses, uh, has enough hogs to clean, and then of course you have the wizards that came uh, around the right side and down the base. There's a lot of high uh, hit point buildings down there, but he does have enough time to clean up and um, this attack, I believe, was about two minutes long, so a very good, uh, swift attack. The timing on the hogs was excellent as well. So yeah, guys, it uh, really helps to, to draw out your attacks, um, make guesses as to where um, you think bombs are, where you think Teslas are, etc. Um, also, on for uh, you know golem hog attacks, um, keep an eye on where you want to enter. Um, if you looked at this base in particular, it almost made no sense to come in from 9 o'clock or 8 o'clock with your golem um, crew you wouldn't be eliminating any significant double bomb spots, so the 11, 12 o'clock position was the best spot for that. As always, guys, like, subscribe. Um, I'm going to try to pump out more content here pretty soon when I get some time. Uh, thanks for watching.